exactly what I'm gonna be talking about. I'm just gonna let y'all know how my week been and I'm gonna eat this food because I haven't had Chipotle in a long time. So first let's get into the food, right? I got the new steak that they got like with the cilantro or whatever. I got some corn, I got some cheese, I got some chicken, I got white rice. This is usually what I get. Um, I have not tasted this steak because I have not been to Chipotle in a long time. So, yeah. So, I'm going to eat and I'm going to let y'all know about how my week been because I feel like, I feel like y'all just need to know. And look at that. Ooh. But, when y'all got to forgive me for how I look. But this is how I look on a regular basis, so. But anyway, so let me tell y'all. So first and foremost, if you don't follow me on Instagram, which you should, but if you don't, at official Mother Bonita, I got shouted out by my favorite freaking person ever. Yes, I'm gonna say my favorite freaking person ever. Greg. So y'all know I did that haul, right? So he seen my video and he put it on his page. And like, y'all, I promise you, it's been the best thing ever because people been hitting me up. Like all these different, like people from all over the world have been looking at my Instagram and it's just been so good. And this is bomb. Um, and y'all, so, so y'all, that's like really good because first and foremost, he usually don't post regular people that are not celebrities on his page and he posted me, he posted my YouTube video, he mentioned my, like my song was in it and so thank you, Greg. I was happy, y'all. I was so happy. Like I screamed it all. So that was the highlight of my week. Now, let me tell y'all about the tea of my week, the drama of my week, okay? So, let me eat some more. This is really bomb. Really, really bomb. I don't know how y'all do mung bands and out because... I just gotta enjoy my food. Okay. That was really bomb. Look at it. It's tender. It was fresh when she gave it to me. Look at that. Mm. But. But okay, so the tea, y'all, the tea of the week is, so I got on Facebook, right? I got on Facebook the other day. You okay? Y'all, Gabby over there, she got a cold. But I got on Facebook the other day and I, I mentioned something about like, you know, it being National Daughters Day because it was. And y'all already know I'm a single mother. And I have an absentee other person to my children, right? So I mentioned something and I was like, watch this person post their children and they haven't even did nothing in money. So this is the tea. His friend, that person who I'm talking about, decided to say to me some stuff like, y'all, it's a 
Oh, it's so meow. This is some really good steak. Gabby, you like it? But, so, this person is gonna say to me like, I'm tired of you bashing him. And, um, uh, something. See y'all, this is why I can't talk and eat. This is tea. So, a friend of his decided to comment to me, like, I'm tired of you bashing him. You don't let him see his kids, blah, 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 blah. Let me tell y'all, because I'm very open. And I want to say this to the single mothers out there. If the other parent to your children is not putting the best interest of the child um, ahead of their self for their child, no. They don't need to be in the presence of that of that that person and and this specific person that i'm talking about i mean he didn't need a lot like i didn't already told y'all this man didn't put put his hands on me i didn't told y'all that this man is absentee he could care less about anything this way so um <clears throat> it's just like as a mother you know what's best for your child like i've always told him once you get yourself together and you know, and you're actually ready to be a parent, then you're more than welcome to be in your children's life. But these, these young parents out here who like to just smoke and run the streets and do all this crazy stuff, no ma'am, no ma'am, no sir, no Pam, no, 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 no. It's not, I don't, I don't let that be around my kids. My kids are, my kids are, anointed they just no no my kid's not even around people who cuss so uh uh so up so up see see I don't know uh the C circle I don't know how y'all be eating and then and then doing videos I'm gonna eat my food. Okay. You done? Okay. A lot of people, they want to stick their noses in places that they don't know. Like, if you don't know the relationship that I had with my child's father, you can't speak on it. If you don't know the relationship that he has with his children, you can't speak on it. So, you know, it's it's unfortunate for people to be without, you know, parents or whatever. But, I mean, that's life. That's life. And you can't hold on to somebody who doesn't want to be a father. You just have to do what you got to do because you're the parent. And that's what I do. So, you know... I'm just not for the, the baby, the baby daddy mess. Not for it, y'all. Not for it. Let me tell y'all. So, I've been working on merch for my website. I'm about to uh, actually do, like, a whole revision of my website because I had a stalker. Um, I had a stalker, and they got into my stuff. So, I'm about to change the whole website. My new website is going to be... The name is going to be released. You know, I'm not going to say it. The name is going to be released probably... In my next video and on my Instagram but I've been working on my merch so that's um one of my phone cases I got shirts and stuff because people be wanting you know they said mother where's the merch where's the merch and I want to be like my um my sister Lola Star with all the merch and stuff. So, and go check out my sister's YouTube. Um, well, actually, she don't do YouTube no more. But check out her Instagram at the Lola Star. She's very big. Okay. Um, but yeah. So, yeah, y'all. Like, like I said, God blessed me enough to be on a celebrity stylist 
page with my YouTube. So I'm very grateful and very humble for that because that, that didn't have to happen, but it did. And it exposed me to a lot of different people, a lot of different like um, investors and like just, I put a post up on my Facebook. So if y'all follow me on Facebook, go look at that. Um, but yeah, and it just motivated me more because it's like, okay, I'm doing my business class. I'm going to do another one. Um, I want to reinvent my website. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna get some merch. Let's get merch. Um, I'm working on my kids' business and stuff. And you know, the downside was the baby daddy mess. But who cares about that? But um, yeah, y'all. Okay.